Okay, my name is Devin. I'm Megan. And I'm Jordan. And today we're going to be interviewing people on their experiences with bullying because we think that it's a really important cause to try and end because it has a really large effect on so many people in the world today and it really needs to end. So we're going to be seeing what other people have to say about it and what their experiences are. Hello, what's your name? I'm Aurora. Okay, we're going to interview you on some of your experiences with bullying. So, um, in what ways do you think bullying occurs in this school? Like, do you think it's really common? Um, in high, in middle school, not so much, because I think that's just like the beginning of what's about to happen in high school. But I feel like in high school, it's a lot worse because there's older kids, um, pretty much. I think people do it because like they're just jealous or they're hurting themselves. Hi, I'm Kaylee Brulier. Have you ever been bullied? Yeah. Uh, how did it affect you? Um, it made me feel bad about myself. Does it have any long-term effects on you? No. Hi, I'm Bridget. So, have you ever been bullied? Yeah. Because, <laughs> well, I think it was, it was my fault because I was being a little butthead. Um, but, like, I, I said something wrong, and then, like, they started, like, being mean to me because of my choice of words. But, yeah. So, did it have any like long-term effects on you? No, I kind of like I forget about things a lot, and it's really easy for me to forget about things. So, so have you bullied anyone yourself? Yeah, I was a bully from like first grade to like third grade, and I was like I got physical, and I mean like I grew out of that. Mostly, I hope. I'm John Connell, and I go to Quaker Town. Hey, John, do you think that bullying is a major issue in the school? Um, not really. Have you ever been bullied personally? No. Have you ever bullied anyone? Yes. Um, do you have any regrets with that? Yes. Um, how do you think it affected that person or people? Um, not really sure. Hi, my name is Jarrett Laux. Have you ever, like, helped anyone that was being bullied? Uh, yes, I believe I have. Do you, um, remember if you've ever said anything to anyone or bullied them at all? I'm gonna be honest, I did. It was because I was very mad at them, and I just didn't learn how to, like, properly hand it. But yeah, I feel really bad about it. And I've apologized. It's just, I regret it, saying that. Yeah. Do you have any advice to people that are being bullied? Mm, don't let it bother you. What do you have to say to people that think that bullies a joke? Um, it's not. So do you have any advice for people that are being bullied? Talk to someone about it. My name's Harold Sanchez. Have you ever witnessed bullying in the school? No. Okay, that's good. What do you have to say to people that think bullying's a joke? I'm like, it's not a joke because it can really give you like depression or it can make you think of like something as bad as like suicide. What do you have to say to people that think bullying is just a joke? It's not a joke. How do you think you can personally stop bullying or help the problem? I don't think there really is a way to stop bullying. Do you know what I mean? Because like people are always going to do it. It's not like they're going to say like, there's just, I don't think they're going to stop. You just have to learn ways to cope with it and eventually it gets better. Do you have any advice to people that are being bullied that you might not see? Get help.